everyone welcome back to my channel jay's curtis face today i have an after christmas sale haul for you before i get into the haul you know i gotta take a moment to welcome you back hey and if you're new welcome if you are new and wonder what we do here we do crafts hauls and diys with all that said let's get on to this after christmas sale haul I am one of those people who love to go after Christmas sale shopping. Basically, you just go to the stores and, you know, get the Christmas stuff on sale. Normally, I like to wait till it gets marked down a little bit more. But lately, the stores haven't had that much um, products, period. So, it doesn't even get down to like 70%. So, today, well, actually, Target did get down to 70%. So, I went to Walmart, Walgreens, and Target. So, and I got a good amount of things. So, I'm going to be actually doing three um, different videos because I don't like my videos to be too long. I normally like to get like Christmas decorations for the next year. I make sure I try to get wrapping paper. I was able to get wrapping paper, but there were no Christmas decorations by the time I got there. Y'all, I had a late start this year. I wasn't feeling that well. So, I didn't get up and get out and get to so, it. I still was able to get out and get some things and I didn't get any perfume. I usually like to get sets of perfume and I like to give my grandma like a set of white diamonds. Um, I don't know if you're familiar with Elizabeth Taylor, but she has, well, she's passed away, but there was a, this is a set of perfume, it's called White Diamonds. My grandma loves it and I always buy it at Christmas and then give it to her Mother's Day. And my daughter's birthday in February, my oldest daughter, and I always buy her perfume set and give it to her for her birthday, but I have zero perfume set. <laughs> Like I said, there I go getting rants and y'all know I will talk forever. So let's get on to this haul for real. So the first store I think I'm going to do it is Walgreens. Walgreens is where I was able to find like the, the gift sets, the really cute gift sets. So the first thing I got was, and I was able to use my Walgreens cash on it. So my Walgreens order was really good. I made really good. I made out really good at Walgreens. So the first thing I got was this Soap and Glory brand. And this is just three body butters. And I think it's like the original pink, cocoa, and call of fruity. So my daughters, um, they like this brand. My middle daughter loves it. So what I'm going to do is just probably separate these. And since it's pink, of course, I'm thinking ahead. Valentine's Day. I like to give them a little cute, like, you know, Valentine's Day basket. So I'll probably break this up. That's another thing I like to do with these sets. You can break them up and give them as separate gifts. Or you can just keep them and use them for yourself. So the next thing I got are good, like, just mail gifts to stock up on. And things like this don't really, like... If I have this in my gift bin, I have a, like a little plastic bin in my closet where I put my, my gifts at. This will stay until next Christmas. It's not like it's going to go bad or anything. But the first thing I got was this Old Spice and it ended up being $5. And there's that one. Next I got, I think that's the same kind. I don't even know. I, I wasn't even looking at the scents. I was just grabbing. And, and here's this one, Axe. Last one I thought was, I didn't know this was for men when I grabbed it, but... Okay, whatever. You know, it's just $5. I'll keep it. But I, I thought it was like a shave gel. Like Nivea, I just was thinking women. And I thought it was like a shave gel set. But when I got home, I realized it was for men. So that was all I got at Walgreens. And like I said, those sets were $5. And I had my Walgreens cash. If you still are able to get out to do the sales, I recommend Target. Next year, I'm going to Target first. I've never been to Target after Christmas sales until Target hits 90% off. But Target starts off after Christmas 70% off, except for like the food and the candy, which like I don't need any more candy. But like all these sets and the wrapping paper and the decorations were 70% off. So the first one I got was this vitamin. I don't I can't really pronounce that, but it's like a, a lip care mask and like an under eye mask set. And there's two of each. So I'm going to break this up and put this in my daughter's Valentine's Day basket, especially because look at that lips. That's definitely like Valentine's Day. So next I got these lashes. So I got one, this one, and I got the other one, this one. And like I said, these are Valentine's Day colors. I'm like, they are, this is too perfect. And these end up being, I'm sorry, these end up being $3. And this was $3 as well. I have this Burt Bees um, brightening gel mask and it has a lip balm as well. And it's just like a face mask with a lip balm. And I got two of these and this was like a dollar forty something. So I grabbed them one of each. And y'all, you know me, I'm thinking way, way ahead. I'm gonna put this up probably for Easter. Next, I got two of these, and oh, these were like three or four dollars. And it's a Maybelline, as you can see. Um, I'm trying to get the glare out, but there's a sky high mascara and a lip gloss right there. So this looks perfectly perfect for um Valentine's Day. And I'm thinking way ahead to next Christmas. Um 
if you see my elf gift basket here, our elf, her name is Snowflake and she comes, I want to say, I forget when, I think she comes after Thanksgiving, but anyway, she leaves the girls a elf basket, a gift when she comes and it's just like Christmas themed items that they can wear all Christmas season and I grabbed these nails and they were two dollars and like 30 cent I want to say and I grabbed them each I even grabbed myself a pair and I thought these were so cute just little kiss Christmas nails I'm trying to get it close without there we go without the glare but look how cute that is so I got them each one of these for their elf basket I know y'all like I said I think ahead now this next set actually came from Walmart and this is a I still don't really know what this is Oh, a mask set. So there's like three little masks in here and then two little paper masks. But like I said, these colors look like Valentine's Day. They're going to be so cute in the Valentine's Day basket. So next I got this Cantu and this is just like hair products. There's a shampoo, conditioner, a detangler, and like a styling cream. This whole set was $5. It was $4.99 and it comes with a scarf and it's for kids, but anybody can use this for their hair. And I buy the detangler anyway, the detangler, and it's like $5. So the, to get the whole set, that was a deal. And the funny thing is when I was sitting there looking at it and kind of thinking like, do I want to get more? Ladies saw me pull this out and they went ahead and grabbed them. So I couldn't even go back to get more. You got to be fast when you're like after Christmas shopping. So the next um, like hair set I got is this other Cantu set. And this ended up being $5 as well. And this has like, um, like a gel, a brush. And I don't know if you can see, but it has these hair jewels that my girls wear in their braids. So yeah, $5, which one of those products alone can cost more than $5. So to get the whole gift set for $5 is a steal. So next at Target, I got this Eco Brush. Um, it's for your feet. And there's a pumice stone and then there's a foot brush. And I thought these were really nice. Um, I'm going to put it in my gift bin. I don't know if I'll give this to my girls for Valentine's Day or for Easter or whatever. But I also grabbed one for myself as well. So I grabbed three of each. And also the Eco Tools. And this was a dollar like 40 something. And I got this Eco Tools dry brush set. And I got three of each of these too. And this is just so you can like do the dry brushing on your body, on your skin. Especially this time of year. I probably would just go ahead and give this to them now because this is you know, perfect for winter to get that dead skin off of you. This is going to be put up for next Christmas. I know y'all, but I, I do that all the time. And this is a spa life in a six sheet mask and they're shaped like letters to Santa. I thought, and it tells you on the back, like what kind they are. I thought this was too, too cute. So I definitely grabbed this. And like I said, I'll be splitting it up because there's six of them in here. So I'll probably give each of them three for their um, elf baskets for next year. Or I might put this in a Christmas stocking next year. So next I got, which I could not believe when I saw this because, okay, it's the bath bomb set. I paid like $3 for it. And look at the um, shapes of them. Chocolate bar, chocolate strawberry, and a macaroon. I know this was a Christmas set, but this is definitely going in their Valentine's Day basket. I was like, it's like it was meant for me to like, you know, do a very thrifty Valentine's Day basket. I thought this was so cute. And this is going to be, this is actually so cute. And it's chocolate scented. And it's, I mean, what better thing to put in a Valentine's Day gift basket than chocolate scented gift bath bombs? So the next thing I got was this Yeti cup and it was like a dollar 40. I'm sorry, I don't know the exact numbers and it just says Yeti or not, it's Christmas time. And I'm just gonna put this up for my youngest daughter for her, um, I might give this to her now though. My oldest daughter's for Christmas got like a Starbucks cup and she was a little jealous. So I might just give her this one now, but, um, or I might put it up for her basket for next year. That's the end of this haul. I have quite a amount of items. So I'll just be doing, I think two more videos after this. So with that said, I will see you next time. I will see you next haul, next craft, next DIY. And, and I hope y'all are had a Merry Christmas if you celebrate Christmas. And I will see you next time. Bye. <laughs>